Cobra Kai is an American martial arts comedy drama television series and a sequel to the original The Karate Kid films by Robert Mark Kamen. The series was created by Josh Heald, John Hurwitz, and Hayden Schlossberg, and is distributed by Sony Pictures Television. The series was released on YouTube Red slash YouTube Premium for the first two seasons, before moving to Netflix starting with the third. The series stars Ralph Macchio and William Zabka, who reprise their roles as Daniel LaRusso and Johnny Lawrence from the 1984 film The Karate Kid and its sequels, The Karate Kid Part 2 and The Karate Kid Part 3. The first season launched on YouTube Red on May 2, 2018, with the second season following on April 24, 2019. After production of season 3 was completed, YouTube decided to stop producing scripted original programming, leaving the show without a home. Netflix acquired the series in June 2020, and has helmed production and release of the series since. The third season was released on January 1, 2021. Netflix renewed the series for a fourth season, which was released on December 31, 2021 and a fifth, which was released on September 9, 2022. Cobra Kai begins in the fall of 2017, and re-examines the Miyagi-verse narrative from Johnny's point of view, beginning with his decision to reopen the Cobra Kai Karate Dojo, and the rekindling of his old rivalry with Daniel. Cobra Kai also stars Courtney Hengeller, Colo Mariduena, Tanner Buchanan, Mary Mauser, Jacob Bertrand, Johnny DeKenzo, Peyton List, Vanessa Rubio, and Dallas Dupree Young, with Martin Cove and Thomas Ian Griffith also reprising their roles from the films. The series attained high viewership on both YouTube and Netflix, and has received critical acclaim for its writing, performances, action sequences, humor, character development, and homage to the previous films. It has received numerous awards and nominations, with the third season being nominated for Outstanding Comedy Series at the 73rd Primetime Emmy Awards. Cast and Characters Main None Recurring None Guests None. Episodes. Production. Development. In October 2020, Netflix renewed Cobra Kai for a fourth season prior to the third season's release. The renewal came following Netflix's acquisition of the series after its previous streamer, YouTube, was not interested in renewing the series for a fourth season due to a shift in content focus. Josh Heald, John Hurwitz, and Hayden Schlossberg returned as writers and executive producers through their production company, Counterbalance Entertainment. Will Smith, James Lasseter, and Kalieb Pinkett also returned as executive producers with the Overbrook Entertainment Production Company. Series stars Ralph Macchio and William Zabka were CEO executive producers. Susan Ekins was the executive producer for distributor Sony Pictures Television. Prior to this season's release, Netflix renewed the series for a fifth season in August 2021. Casting All previous series regulars, Ralph Macchio, William Zabka, Courtney Hengeller, Colo Mariduena, Tanner Buchanan, Mary Mauser, Jacob Bertrand, Johnny DeKenzo, and Martin Cove, returned to this season. Vanessa Rubio and Peyton List, who recurred since the first and second seasons respectively, were added to the main cast. Thomas Ian Griffith also joined the main cast as Terry Silver, reprising his role from The Karate Kid Part 3. The role for Griffith is his first since 2007 when he turned to writing. Meanwhile, Dallas Dupree Young and Una O'Brien joined the series in recurring roles to portray Kenny and Devon two school students who turned to karate. Nicole Brown, who recurred throughout the first two seasons as Aisha Robinson, and Paul Walter Hauser, who recurred in the second season as Stingray, both returned in a guest capacity. Carrie Underwood made a guest appearance in the season as herself, performing a song from the original Karate Kid soundtrack. Yuji Okumoto returned as chosen Taguchi, and Makio's daughter, 
Julia, appeared as Daniel's cousin, Vanessa. Filming Filming for the season began in Atlanta, Georgia, on February 26, 2021. Additional filming took place in Los Angeles, California. Filming concluded on April 30th. Music The Def Leppard song Rock of Ages was used in a promotional trailer for the season. The Moment of Truth, a song performed by Survivor and written by Bill Conti, Dennis Lambert and Peter Beckett for the original film, was performed during the season by Carrie Underwood. Heald stated that Underwood was a fan of the series and that her appearance was kept secret until the performance was filmed, causing an authentic reaction from the extras on set. Other featured music from the season included songs from Judas Priest, Poison, Rat, Journey, Foreigner, and Rio Speedwagon, as well as Motley Crue's Girls, Girls, Girls. Hurwitz said the producers also wanted to include music from AC slash DC, Bon Jovi, and Guns N' Roses, but were unable to do budget constraints. The airborne song Breakin' Out of Hell, suggested by music supervisor Michelle Johnson, was used in place of AC slash DC's Thunderstruck, a song that was written into the script but was unable to be used, also due to budget concerns. Soundtracks Volume 1 Volume 2 Marketing and Release The first teaser trailer was released on August 5, 2021, which featured promotional videos of the cast members and confirmed a December release date for the season, which was set for December 31. An extended trailer advertising the season was later released on December 9. Prior to the season's release, a virtual premiere screening was held on December 28. The screening, limited in number of attendees, featured a welcome from Heald, Hurwitz and Schlossberg, a full screening of the first episode, and a question and answer session with the cast. The Q&A was released on the series' social media accounts following the screening and was hosted by Jacqueline Coley, an editor at Rotten Tomatoes. The season was released on DVD on September 13, 2022, a few days after the show's fifth season premiered on September 9. Reception Critical Response On the review aggregator website Rotten Tomatoes, the season holds a score of 95% with an average rating of 7.9-10 based on 38 reviews. The website's critical consensus reads, Cobra Kai still delights in a fourth season that mines great fun from shifting alliances, chiefly the uneasy truce between Johnny Lawrence and Daniel LaRusso. Meanwhile, on Metacritic, which uses a weighted average, the season has a score of 70 out of 100 indicating generally favorable reviews. Christina Escobar with the AV Club wrote that the season nicely continues the journeys of our favorite Valley Karate fanatics delivering fun along with impressively high kicks, moments of true emotion, and just enough stunted development to keep it all spinning and praised newcomer Dallas Dupree Young, noting the similarities between his character and Macchio's original character from the films. The Chicago Sun-Times' Richard Roper said the season was quite ridiculous but remained entertaining. James Dyer, a writer for Empire Online, noted that most plot lines throughout the season were expanded on from the third film in the franchise, but that it introduces its own existential discord. The IGN writer Amelia Emberwing felt that it was obvious while watching the season that it was the first to be wholly produced by Netflix. Emberwing however, did state that it was still one hell of a ride. Rebecca Theodore Vacan of IndieWire opined that the series faithfully honors its roots while managing to tell new and compelling stories.